integral of cos x into cos 2 x into cos 3 x dx. So, we have integral of product of 3 cos functions. Now, we know that when we have product of functions, it is little bit difficult to find out the integral, but we have trigonometric transformations which will help us to transform the product into sum. We can use this formula which says that 2 cos a cos b is equal to cos of a plus b plus cos of a minus b. Now, that formula if I am able to use on the given problem and apply that to two times, then maybe we should be able to get this into a standard integral form. So, let us go ahead and do that. Now, I have to pick which functions I will apply this. I will take the first and last. I can do it in any way, but I will take last and first because when I add them, I will get 4 and I, when I subtract, I will get them. So, let us go ahead and do that. For that, I have to multiply and divide with 2. So, first we will divide with 2, 1 by 2 into, we will take that cos x cos 3 x multiplied with 2 as one group and that we multiply with whatever is left out that is cos 2 x dx. Now, applying the transformation, we can write this as cos of a plus b that is 3 plus 1 4 cos 4 x plus 3 minus 1 is 2 x. So, we can write it as cos 4 x plus cos 2 x into cos 2 x dx. Let us go to the next step. In the next step, we can open the brackets. We will have cos 4 x cos 2 x plus cos square 2x. Now, again one more time we will do transformation here and we know what is cos square 2x. It can be written as 1 plus cos 4x. So, let us go to the next step that is equals to half integral of. Now, we want to multiply and divide with 2 again. So, I will write down 2 cos 4x cos 2x divided by 2 dx plus, we forgot and dx here earlier, sorry, plus we have 1 by 2 integral of cos square x which is equals to 1 plus cos 4x divided by 2. We are able to write this, let us understand. We have cos 2x equals to 2 cos square x minus 1, which gives us that 2 cos square x equals to 1 plus cos 2 x. Now, when we take these angles to multiple level, we can write down 2 cos square 2 x equals to 1 plus cos 4 x. That is what we have done there. Now, let us go to the next step. In the next step, we will have separate them, we will have 1 by 2 integral of, applying the transformation here, we will have cos a plus b that is cos 6 x plus cos a minus b that is cos 2 x dx plus 1 by 4 integral of 1 plus cos 4 x and we have dx there. This will be equal to 1 by 4 into integral of cos 6x is sin 6x by 6 plus cos 2x integral is sin 2x by 2 plus 1 by 4 integral of 1 is x plus integral of cos 4 x is sin 4 x by 4 plus c. So, we can write this as x by 4 plus sin 2 x divided by 8 
plus sin 4x divided by 16 plus sin 6x divided by 24 plus c. So, the integral of cos x cos 2x cos 3x equals to x by 4 plus sin 2x by 8 plus sin 4x by 16 plus sin 6x by 24 plus c.